Huzzah! What's going on? Hey, it's time for Storm's weekly update. Hope you had a great Thanksgiving. Hope you had a good week. So, let's talk about what's going on. First off, right off the bat, so I didn't do this last Monday like my plan is to always do it every Monday, but last week, obviously, you know, holidays, more working, things like that. I uploaded all the new creatures and stuff to the Grow Gallery at stormthebar.com and that is for Final Fantasy 7. That is our game we're working on right now. Uh, I'm actually going to be, once this video is published and up, I'm going to be actually on stream doing some more photos in Final Fantasy and going from there. So yeah, so that's the newest one. You can check that out in a moment. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put the pictures up for the latest or the ones that are not in the gallery. So you get kind of a little little special preview or a little special look at some of the ones that we took while on stream that are not going into the galleries. Not yet, at least, because with the landscapes and things like that, I'm still working on that project. What else is going on? Um, I picked up a few new games for Black Friday and for um, Cyber Monday. Definitely focusing on those open world RPGs. So we got some really cool ones to check out and stuff like that. Chernobylite. Dragon's Dogma, that's got a photo mode, that's going to be fun for the Rogues Gallery. Uh, uh, Kingmaker, Pathfinder, and stuff like that. I want to see how that runs on the PS5. I loved it on PC. I'd love to play it again. Maybe do like an evil playthrough. I haven't tried that yet. So that would be kind of cool. And yeah, so stuff like that. Uh, Guardians of the Galaxy, another one uh, I picked up on Black Friday. Awesome that it went on sale. So that's going to be cool. So while I'm talking about this, let's go ahead and look at those pictures, by the way. And uh, da, 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 da. not a random. I'll just do a loop. Okay, cool. All right. So while those are going on, let's talk about also what's up. So as I talked about, we're going to be working. There hasn't been a top five. It hasn't come out in a little bit because I've been working on some reviews of other games and stuff first before I put a new top five out. So I want to get some uh, I want to get some stuff in mind for what I want to do. So games I've been playing are like Van Helsing, Elix, stuff like that. Those are games I want to put on top five. Oh, King of Seas as well. Great indie action RPG, open world, a pirate game where the uh, ship is your main character per se. You have a main character in the storyline, but the ship is like that's your main thing. That's the thing you put the loot on. That's the thing you get you get loot for. That's the thing you upgrade, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So which is really cool. Uh, beyond that, obviously, photo mode. We're working on Final Fantasy. Next is going to be Guardians of the Galaxy, so that's going to be a big one. I'll be looking forward to jumping into that. And for this week, though, we'll definitely be working on Final Fantasy. We'll be working on some of the other games, which will probably be like, you know, after playing Final Fantasy for a few hours and taking a break and then going back and doing that. So we'll be doing those. I think Van Helsing is the one I'm going to be working on. I was playing Elix. It's still a good game, but uh, the leveling system, it's still something I'm just still not getting over the best. So I don't know. That I might just keep for myself off stream. I don't know. I haven't decided with that. I might just keep going anyway. I do want to see that storyline finished, though, because I do like the storyline. I do like the characters and stuff. So it's it, it's a tough one for some people to get into, though, because, like again, it's that whole Eurojank thing. Even for myself, I'm kind of like, ooh, I've been playing like two-handers on easy mode, and I've been enjoying it without a doubt but like i said i would like to see it to the end so but it's kind of a weird system the way they do their questing and the way they do their enhance their advancements and stuff like that not like your typical ones that you're used to for when it comes to rpgs so so that's something anyway uh i've been playing around with that there is a new series i'd like to start working on that uh, i haven't haven't started yet but i would like to start doing it is how a game plays on ps5 in terms of games that we've done for the old so i was talking about doing this before which was kind of like doing new playthroughs of games we played on uh, top five reasons to play originally back on the ps4 ps4 pro i'd like to see how they run on the five and then kind of give like a little video because i've had a lot of people that have hit me up in the comments for different games from my old top fives that have asked me oh you know have you played on ps5 it's got 60 fps it's got you know how's it runs it's screen tearing things like that and those are games i'd like to go back and because some of them have been surprising like some of the indie ones especially like they have actually been enhanced or when you you know when you load them up they get that kind of like boost 
you know that whole PlayStation boost thing going on so some of them have been like moved to 60 FPS some of them do run actually better than they did originally so games like that you know and then there's cars games that have been enhanced in general like Mortal Shell and you know Final Fantasy 7 remake has even been enhanced more with the photo mode and stuff so those are games I'd like to go back and do small videos on just to explain what the new look like what how it feels is it smooth does it run good is it not screen tearing stuff like that what games you might want to go back and play again yourself and whatnot so and then i don't know we'll see about doing like a, a, a full-on like playthroughs and whatnot i know those are kind of tough for unless your channel like really just sticks to that type of stuff it's like kind of tough for some people so We'll see what happens on that end. But anyway, um, I do con you know, want to continue doing that. Obviously, live stream is going to kick off pretty soon on YouTube, staying on YouTube. Um, I talked about this before. Uh, I've jumped between YouTube and then Twitch and then back. So, But I'm staying here for good because I want to keep all my content. As much as people say you don't want to like you know keep everything in one basket, I kind of want to keep everything in one basket, to be honest. Because I find that especially if I'm doing one on the other, it's making me not want to do the content on one like so if i'm streaming on twitch i'm not making videos as much that's hence another reason why the top fives have been very like you know haven't been done in a while so that's why i want to start focusing more on that and do that kind of stuff so yeah so that's that's pretty much it that's the weekly update so this week keep an eye out for final fantasy 7 streams we're doing photo mode keep an eye out for other games like uh, van helsing and stuff we'll be playing through those and uh, getting those ready for the top five reasons of course anybody who's in the stream always gives me a hand or is allowed to get you know is you know come in and help me out on their top five reasons or their reasons that they like it and we can put those together and then in the end make one you know make a video about uh, the top five reasons to play so and then we'll start looking at that new series and see how that works out. So, yeah. Have a great one. Be safe. Be just. And I'll see you guys either in stream or in the comment section on the videos and all that good stuff. Huzzah.